Hey everyone, this is Sarah from Children's Ministry and this is your preschool video for Sunday, July 23rd. Thank you for serving. You all are so wonderful. So we will be focusing on day seven of creation as well as the attribute of God, which is God wants us to rest our bodies and spirits. So a few things, if you haven't grabbed um, a calendar yet, you can get that off the counter. Also keep handing out the newsletter. Here's a look at our two incoming activities. So we've got this day seven coloring sheet and also this God creation, God's creation scavenger hunt, which you can have the kids actually take outside and see how many items they can find. You can buddy up, super fun. When we head outside, we will have water balloon toss. So if any of the, um, if anybody can just man those buckets, just to make sure it doesn't turn into a water balloon fight, but it's the object is to hand the preschooler a balloon tot, a balloon and see if they can toss it into a bucket, which is at a little distance away. All right, and then when we head inside, we have our same worship. And our lesson will be a slight continuation of our poster, but we'll be also doing some more physical activities to get the idea of rest and stopping to rest across to our little beloved children. And of course, we always incorporate Jesus into our lessons. And what is Squirmy up to? Well, he needs to rest too and stop playing video games. And our craft, pretty simple. It is a watch to remember to make time for Jesus. And oh, most of it's pre-assembled. So we have the watch band here with the Velcro attached already. You don't have to do that. So what the kids can do, and you can please help them. Um, don't do it yourself, but just please help them to work the brad through the watch and then um, put the watch face on and then they can add these little foam stickers. And what can you do in the classroom when you get back? Well, we've got Jesus Storybook Bible, we've got the Beginner's Bible, we've got the flip chart and also the memory verse. You can go in over any of those things that you want to and just have fun with the kids and share God's word. And just a heads up, the AC is still not working in 105. It'll be working on Monday, but we were able to cool down the room a lot last week and we'll have more fans in there. So I'm just giving you a heads up to dress accordingly because it may get a little warm in that room for our large group time. Anyway, reach out to me with any questions. I'm thankful for each and one of you, each and every one of you, praying that you all have a great week in Christ. Bye.